Hey everyone, it's me Doomlink and welcome back to Let's Play Monster Hunter. It's currently part 3 for my Let's Play and I think these videos are going to be really long, at least for the next uh, 3 or 4 parts, I don't know. We're going to see, because these gathering quests are not particularly lengthy. It is currently the 24th of... what the f... it's January, there you go, I just had to think about what month it was. Apparently I, I'm not living in the present. I'm really not uh, keeping track of what the date is, even though I have to tell you every single time I'm recording. But yeah, anyway. I am keeping track, it's just I couldn't think at that moment. I apologise for that. Wisdom of the Chief updated. I've got some more wisdom. That's great, hunting basics. Good thing I already know the basics. Although this game is starting to challenge me on whether or not I really know the basics, because even the most basic of things have been made complicated by these horrendous controls. But anyway, it seems we have Area 6 available to us now, which is like really awful because it goes 1, 2, 3, 6. If you know anything about ascending numbers, you would know that that's correct! That's exactly how numbers ascend. But anyway, no, of course, that kind of shows you that there is more to the overall map. It's just we're being given only one area. Jeez, this guy is coming up with wisdom like you wouldn't believe. He's just... this guy is way too knowledgeable. It would be a real mistake not to take advantage of his knowledge at this stage. So, we need to collect... Okay, what do we need to collect again? We need to actually collect, I think, three items. It was two spider webs, one something else. No, it was two herbs and one spider web. You know, I, <laughs> I, I had the option, or the ability rather, to buy both of these items at the shop. So, imagine if I just bought those items in the shop, went into the quest and delivered them immediately. Now, that... That is what you call speedrunning right there, but uh, I want to have a real experience in this game, so I'm going to try and uh, try and collect some items, thank you very much. I, I want to... I don't want to just mess around here, like, this is serious business. Anyway, so, I don't really know the gathering points of the forest and hills, to be honest with you, I can't really remember them. I'm assuming this is a collect a gathering point of sorts, herbs, please. There you go. There's one herb. The spider webs are usually pretty obvious, they will be in Area 6, almost certainly. Because, uh, well I can't really remember Area 6. Area 6 is the one that has the weird ascending area, I'm pretty sure. It's a real nightmare to climb it, from memory. I have really bad memories of having to do that in Freedom Unite. Because of course, Freedom Unite, out of all of the uh, older games, was the one that I played the most, like most people. Oh god, it's X to climb, not circle. I'm sorry. Anyway. Oh, Jesus. Frickin' R2 to run. Feels so gross. Anyway. What we're gonna do is look for spiderweb gathering points, and there are some moss swine here. May as well kill them. I don't want them to get in the way of my monster hunting. Or rather, this isn't even monster hunting, what I'm doing right here. I'm just, you know... I I'm spiderweb hunting, or spider hunting. You know, there are spider monsters. I mean, there's the Nursilla, but that was a few generations ahead of this one. <laughs> oh yeah, let's fight the Nursilla in this game. No, I don't know where I'm going to actually find these spider webs, but I have a distinct feeling that if I press the circle button one more time, I'm going to scream. No, that's not what I'm getting the feeling of. What I'm getting the feeling of, that's not really a good sentence that I'm speaking right there, but I think it'll be at the very top of this crap, and I don't know if I'm going to make it up here. Can I jump that high? Is that... No, I didn't think so. I would have been very surprised had I been able to do that. The camera is doing some seriously funky shit right now. Like, you think you know funky, but I'm telling you, there's, there's, there is a level of funk going on here that you... you just can't really comprehend it. Like, this is, this is 70s level right here, so... Where... I mean, I don't even know if funky is something that can be associated with the 70s, but anyway, let's go up here, this seems a lot more... Well, this seems like it's going to take us somewhere, whereas the other direction really was not going to do that. This... this is progress right here, we're, we're learning, oh Jesus, this is not a good start. The, ooh, there you go, wow, that's full-on platforming for you, right? Or I could have just taken the vines, yeah, that would have worked a little better, wouldn't it? Far out. Alright, so I'm using the R2 to... No, I'm not using the R2 to climb faster. Apparently that doesn't exist in this game. Or can I press X? No, I can't. Alright, so you just climb and that's it, basically. 
Fair enough. That is the nature of climbing mechanics in game series. It seems that you start off doing the slowest climb possible, and then as the games continue along, you are able to climb faster and faster. That seems to be a consistent thing across all game series. But anyway, let's, uh, I guess, yeah, here we go. Spiderweb. Ivy. All right, well, how about we just collect these anyway? I don't think we can purchase ivy, so we may as well collect them while we're in front of them. It takes a while to gather in this game, actually. I have to dig around for a while. There's a bit of a... There was gathering lag there. You think hit lag is bad? Yeah, well, try gathering lag. It's really freaking demanding on the system, but uh, what's that in there? Just... I mean, that's a cave in there, but we can't access it this time around, so... I'm hoping for some spider webs. <sighs> Still trying to get my head around this... Uh flipped circle and X button thing. Here we go, there's a big frickin' spiderweb here. I wonder what we're gonna be collecting from this thing. <laughs> uh, um, oh, here we go. I was getting really worried there. I wasn't able to collect, but uh, there we go. I'm gonna collect... Is it even worth collecting as many spiderwebs as I can here? I can actually buy them now. This would actually be really useful in the later games, but in this game, of course, I can just go right ahead and buy them, which is really interesting. But... Uh, Jeez, uh, how many are you going to give me? There we go. So anyway, that's about it for this quest, guys. Where's my Farcaster? I don't know, but I'd love to have one at this stage. That was really good camera work there, game. Thanks for that. Alrighty. So let us now head back to the camp. This is more or less mission complete. I need to go in this direction. I'm losing stamina. Where's my well done steak? I turned it in in the previous quest. What a shame. Looks like I'll have to uh, not run the entire distance to the camp because I'll have a problem with my stamina. I would like to talk to the old guy, but I wouldn't at the same time, so I won't. If that makes any sense to you whatsoever. I hope it does. If it doesn't, then, well... I guess I'll have to deal with that. That's going to be my emotional journey as I continue through this Let's Play. Dealing with the fact that you don't understand what I'm saying the majority of the time. But anyway, I'm going to deliver those herms. And the spider... Yeah, it was a little bit delayed with the spiderweb delivery there. I was a bit worried. I was like, wait, did you deliver the spiderwebs or what? Because if you didn't, then I just wasted my time collecting that shit. You only needed the herbs, game. Stop messing with me. But anyway... I really want to use these binoculars, but you have to use them sparingly. It's like... It's like making a really, really crude joke. You can't just say it all the time. You have to spring it on people. Like, basically, you... You establish this image of yourself with people who are kind of like acquaintance level. Not really friends yet. And then you just whip out a fucking joke. It's, it's almost like whipping out your genitalia, but in word form. Because everyone goes, uh, what? And then, yeah, mission accomplished. That, that's uh, some social advice from your old friend Doomlink. But anyway, we are now saving to a memory card that doesn't exist, and we are now finishing this video. This has been part three, everyone. This was actually a lengthier video than I was expecting. But anyway, I will see you all in part four, where we continue with these weird gathering quests. That's the nature of Monster Hunter, everyone. You're getting the full experience right here. I'll see you guys in part four. Bye-bye.